What's up guys, Trex here, and I'm back with another episode of Trex Plays, and for this episode, I'm going to be playing Big Rigs Over the Road Racing, what looks like a semi-racing simulator. Some There's two strange things about this game, so I've opened it up just once before to test if it records, and instead of saying Big Rigs or O-T-R-R, um, instead it said Car Z with capital Z, like Daisy or whatever. And then another thing that's interesting is the options menu. It's normally set at low, and then these can't go any higher than normal. And also, I made these all higher quality, but didn't remember it. Oh well. But uh, this is Big Rigs Over the Road Racing. This is from 2003, I believe. Um, but yeah, it looks like a semi racing simulator. A low quality semi racing simulator. Look at Oh gosh, these trucks look awful. Mega One, Thunderbolt. Ooh, let's let's race the Thunderbolt. That's a huge thing. Huge truck. Devil Passage. Devil Passage Two. Oh, those look awful. Forgotten Road One, Night Ride, and Small Town. Is, is there a Forgotten Road Two? Oh, and I've just noticed something. There, there's some sort of box right here, and it doesn't completely fit around the image, the thumbnail for the roads. So that's kind of weird. Let's go night ride. Alrighty guys, we are back into big rigs. And uh, so it said carz.exe has cr stopped working. So I guess this was originally supposed to be a game called carz. Let's go back to the Thunder Bowl. And I guess we can do... Hmm. Let's do small town road. Okay, uh, is it Wasid or Arrow Keys? Let's see here. By the way, guys, I'm quite sick at the moment. I've got a pretty bad cold, so I don't think this will be edited as much. Is there any sound? That car is floating, I do believe. Yeah, that car is floating. I is he even going to, um... Uh, uh, the, 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 the start line is floating. Oh, this game is awful already. Okay, well, let's start, and we'll start going around the course. I really don't even think my opponent has even come. Where is he? Is there a rear view button? I don't know. Uh, this car, it's so jittery and awful. It's like the handling is really bad. And it's very, very low quality looking. Uh, turns are so painful. Oh my gosh. Wh where is my opponent? Did he even bother to start? this oh my goodness what is going on here see how quickly we can get across the map uh, pretty quickly actually okay let's see if we can find our place wherever it was there it was so reverse towards it I guess let's try and finish this race Okay, so this is weird. There's no option to restart the race. You just have to return to the game or quit to Windows. That's kind of strange. Okay, I guess let's try a different car. Let's do the Mega One, and let's do Devil Passage. Let's see here. Is my opponent even going to bother to start this time? I hope so. This game has been quite hilarious so far. Oh my goodness. That was 
That was just insane. I I just went straight through the bridge. Okay, yep, you're not even going to bother to come. I know, I'm perfectly fine with that. I'm going to climb this mountain. Wow. Wow. The physics in this game are... They rival... No, they don't rival. They're worse than the physics in Farming Simulator. I can go straight up a mountain if I want to. My estimate is that this game is like 5% done, or 6% done. Oh my goodness, this is awful. And here we see the wild simi frolicking through the mountains. Be careful, do not get close to it, for it will reverse and enter hyperspeed. So apparently I'm just a black car now. It, it's not even bothering to load the textures for my car, even though I'm getting into a lit area. Can I balance on the side of a mountain? Yes, yes I can. I, I can balance on the side of an almost vertical mountain. Oh, this game is absolutely dreadful. Not to mention that I'm clipping through the mountain. What is up with this road? The textures, like, they're loading and unloading and... Oh my goodness. Can I go through this check... Wow. Wow. I can just skip all of the checkpoints. This game... Oh my goodness. Play it for the comedy, not for the racing. That's that's my review on this game. Because I can just go straight through a building. Oh my goodness. This game is awful. Oh, did, the lights, they went through the mountain. The, the off-center lights, they went through the mountain. Like, the lights aren't even on the lamppost properly, but you can see them through the mountain. Oh, this game... It's dreadful. Uh, it's like one or two lines of code to make an object solid, I believe. And they didn't even bother to do that. Who are the developers of this? Uh, whoa! My car's now textured! Oh, no, oh, yep, there, oh. Oh gosh, the lighting engine. This is absolutely awful. Do not play this game. I repeat, do not play this game. Okay, so if you click return to Windows, it doesn't actually return you to Windows, it returns you to the main menu. Hmm. Okay, so we're approaching the end, I'm using Thunder on Small Town Road, and the finish line is right there, there's my opponent, he hasn't moved, and... Whoa. Ugh. Y your winner... It Wow. You're winner. You are winner. Uh, the language is dying. The English language is seriously dying. If they couldn't have put a the in there, you're winner. Oh my gosh. Let's try Forgotten Road 1. And there's no Forgotten Road 2, which is something very, very strange. I like how in the background they put a car that's not even a semi. It's a race car, and this is supposed to be about semi-trucks. That, that describes the quality of this game. Can I go through my opponent? Why, well, yes. Yes, I can. Uh, what is up with that lamppost? It's a neon lamppost. Okay. That's weird. Are trees sold like in every single other game? Nope. Let's go th over the bridge. Oh, I guess not. Oh! Whoa! Oh! Oh! The bridge! What? What is up with it? Oh my... Oh! Uh, why? It's not even on the ground. And it's not even solid. Look at this. Look at this. Okay. I'm going to go over the bridge. Nope. And we just sink straight through it. Ugh. Ugh. And there we are again. What, what, what were the developers thinking when they released this game? It... Oh. This is probably, like, the worst game ever, legitimately. It is nowhere near completion. But it is quite hilarious. I mean, you can just go frolic in the mountains if you want. With your untextured vehicle. Well, it's slightly textured. Ooh, we're riding along the edge of the world. What happens if we fall off? Okay, so the world appears to be built outside of what is... I, I don't even understand. Because you're still moving up and down mountains, but there's no texture. 
There's also no sound to this game, which is really weird. Like, no simple sound effects. No sound... I, I just ran over a person. Well, a low-textured person. Not No textures at all. They're just gray, and I think I saw them pop off the screen. But there's no sound to this game. Not, not even simple sound effects. Ah, my opponent's still waiting for me. Can I cross the finish line without going to all the checkpoints and have it count? Day, night. Day, night. Day, night. Day, night. The Sunrise W12, my opponent for every single race. Okay, so there's apparently no checkpoints for this race. That's that's very, very strange. Something crazy about this game is that it got a meta score of 8. That is way beyond what it should have gotten. It should have gotten a 1 or a 2 at most, but no. It's gotten 8. It's absolutely dreadful. Oh my goodness. Okay, so... This is my review for Big Rigs Over the Road Racing. It's not even Big Rigs Over the Road Racing. It's supposed to be called Car Z. D don't play it. Do not play it unless you're trying to... If you want comedy, then don't play it. I'm sorry, this is a shorter Trex play. There's not very much to this game. If you want to play this game for whatever reason, download will be in the description. Oh my gosh. Wow, this is terrible. But anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. I'm sorry this was shorter. I'm kind of sick today, uh, very light-headed. But, um, yeah, thank you all very much for watching. If you liked the video, then be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel. It really helps out a lot. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.